Hey guys, Preston here in the forum on Denver Broncos face against the 2 and 3 Bisons, who are formerly known as the Oakland Raiders. We'll be facing them in their stadium today. We are off to a semi decent start. I mean, Israel Stark is struggling a bit, but our record is pretty good 4 and 1 on the season so far. And let's see if we can improve it here. A little handshake going, and we are off into the game. It's going to be kick off to Trendon Holiday. And he's going to get a decent return, gets past the 20 yard line down to the 25, and here comes Israel Stark, 1,016 1, yards, 5 touchdowns, 11 picks, and 53.7 completion percentage. He is uh, not doing too good. Only 5 touchdowns to 11 picks, just the accuracy is not there for him, or have been going for him this season, so that's a bit of a struggle right here. Right off the start to the game, or 4th and 1, let's see if... The Denver Broncos can get a fourth down conversion. They are unsuccessful. A little bit glaring blown can. Here comes Alex Smith with 1,000, uh, 1,080 yards, four touchdowns, five picks, and 55.8 completion percentage. He is newly signed because uh, I guess in Kansas City didn't decide not to sign him back. So then the Bison signed him in free agency, and it's going to be a field goal just to start off the game. And just like that, Bison take the lead from the field goal from Josh Brown. And here comes Israel Stark with a little curl route to Jordy Nelson. He's going to get the first down, down to the 34 yard line. And the Broncos are now rolling right now. Second and three now for Stark calling some alls at the line. He's going to drop back, fire a little quick pass to Jordy Nelson, who breaks free from the from the his defender and gets down to the 34 yard line. Looking pretty sharp on the day already, Jordy Nelson. Has been a huge factor for this Denver Broncos team. Just doing a lot of things and just bringing the team to a very, very good record so far. That's going to complete to Mario Manningham and gets into the end zone. And the Broncos take back the lead. Or they never had the lead. So they take the lead 7-3. Third and five now. It's going to be incomplete. And Denver Broncos will take back over the ball. With 2 38 left in the first quarter. Stark can go out left. Find a pass to Julius Thomas' first catch today for 15 yards. Now here's Stark. Play action fake to a Glenn Blount. Going to air one up to Mario Manningham. Who's having a pretty good game of himself. Set two receptions. 43 yards. Now, second and seven now for Stark is going to do a play action fake to look around. Blount start going out left. Fires one, two. Julius Thomas again, who gets a nice pass, gets down to the seven yard line. And Denver is planning the score right here. Just before the dwindling second of the first quarter, Stark trying to keep the pressure. He's going to throw a bad pass, and it's going to be intercepted by the Bison. That pass was intended for a Blount. Stark is the only person who can catch him, and he will get stop the pick six. Jones. And Bisons are in very good position to take the lead right here. Third and five now for Alex Smith. Going to throw on the run complete to Dustin Keller. He's going to do a nice spin move, and he's going to get the verse down. Third down conversions for the Bisons, and Smith is still going. Now, Dustin Keller is going to be in motion. Smith's going to be handed off to Lewis, who's going to do a spin move, and he's going to get some nice blocking, and he will just barely miss the end zone. At the one-yard line, first and goal, Alex Smith. He's going to pitch it to Lewis again, who's going to get into the end zone untouched, and the Bisons take back the lead of a score of 10-3. Now, man in motion for Stark to get the ball back. Seven minutes left in the second quarter. Stark on the fire one's going to be caught by Julius Thomas. Gets the nice reception there 38 yard, at the 38 yard line. Now, the second and four. Pass to Nico Reyes, who is their rookie. I think he drafted him in like the first or second round of this of this past draft. Been a huge help. Very good receiver. He has a lot of room to grow, though. But this is our last season. Uh, well, actually, it might be our last season for Denver Broncos series. Uh, that's why I wanted to go in that a bit. As Israel Stark throws another pick. Uh, this series is going to be the only remaining series for the, for uh, Madden Football on this channel. So I'm looking to end this series around August 25th. That's when Madden 15 is supposed to come out. And this is probably going to be the last season for the Devon Broncos series. Really, I, I'm looking forward to going to Madden 15. Yeah, Madden 25 for the Xbox One, a little iffy. I mean, graphics, I think they could have done a lot better. This is not really the best presentation. But this is going to be probably the la most likely last season for our Devon Broncos. We have, this is game six, so then we have like another couple of more games. We have 16 game seasons, so we're about eight games or nine. No, actually, 10 games. 10 games is the regular season left, and then we have, uh, what do we have? Then we have some playoffs if we make it there. So that should probably bring us around August 25th, around that time. So yeah, this is probably going to be the last season of the Broncos series. I had a lot of fun with the series, uh, second year where we are, we are in right now. I like the idea that I, that I did with uh, getting retiring Peyton Manning and then drafting a rookie quarterback to take his place. 
So it's, it's a half hell of them in the series. So let's get right back to the game. Just barely, uh, almost out of the first half for both teams. Give me a missed tackle by the, the quarterback, and it's gonna be a very long, long wide receiver run for that, for him, and he get down. Now to six yard line, second and five. Now for Alex Smith, he's gonna arrow one up to Dustin Keller, who catches that, and Bisons take back the lead, twenty to fourteen, and we go into the second half. Denver Broncos did not did decide to just receive the ball in the for the first and the first of the game, so then they don't receive it back in the second half. But they do get the ball back first and ten out first. Stark is going to air one up to Jordan Nelson, who, who, kept, who holds on to it, 47 yard line. Stark looking pretty sharp on the day. I mean, 75 completion percentage, 248 yards, two touchdowns, but the three picks just really kill him. Honestly, that's what one of the worst attributes of Stark is accuracy is not really the best. So he throws a lot of picks during the season. That's going to be a successful field goal from Matt Prater, and the lead has been cut from the Bisons of a score of three. They still lead 20 to 17, 17 though. Alex Smith throwing on the run, can be, that's not going to be enough for first down. Third nine out for Stark is going to receive the ball back. Stark is going to go out left, fire one. It's almost going to be picked off again. That would have been his fourth of the game, which isn't really too good. Alex Smith will take the ball back over, and he's going to receive the snap. Third and ten, fire one. It's going to be a nice diving catch for Dustin Keller. Just going all out for the play, and he's not injured the play. Now Alex Smith under pressure, his he throws going to be caught, be re caught by D Dustin Keller, who gets down to the 34 yard line. Third and five now, man in motion for Smith. He's going to go out right, fire across his body or across the field to Lewis, who was one yard short. Now third and 22 for Stark. <laughs> it's going to be a miracle if we can get this third down conversion right here, Stark. And it's going to complete complete to a glaring blowout, no gain, and Bisons take back over the ball. Broncos are down by three points. They really need to start doing something or getting something done right here. It's complete to Eric Decker. No, not enough for the first down. One yard short. But Broncos take it back over. Now Stark trying to escape the pressure. He can't get it away. It's going to be a sack. Seven yard loss. Now third and 17. Now for Stark. He's going to drop back under pressure again. And he's just, this offensive line is now holding their blocks. And there will be a punt away from the Broncos. Now Smith can be a play action fake, then be complete to Lewis, who gets down the field to the 34-yard line. Second eight. Now Alex Smith is going to be in the shotgun, going to receive a snap. Play action fake can be a QB run right here. He's going to get the first down. Almost, a, almost just walked into the end zone. No, basically no one was there. Now at the four-yard line, second one. Well, now for Alex Smith, he's going to receive a snap. Fire one, two. I think Eric Decker. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Decker or Eric Keller. I don't know. And the Broncos aren't looking too good right now. Down by 10 points, 27-17, on four minutes to go. So it's going to be quite a bit of a miracle if, if, Broncos, if the Broncos can actually come back from this. Now it's going to be a hit off second inches to a glaring blount. Gets the first down and keeps this going. Second and 10 now for Stark. Calling some all at the line. They really need the big right here. Nice deep pass. Stark going to air one up. And it's going to be caught by Lucky, who will get down to the five yard line. Well, at the one yard now, second and goal. Laglan and Blount's going to get into the end zone. And this comeback might actually come true. Broncos are down by a field goal. Under two minutes to go, first and 10. Smith can hand off to Lewis, who's going to get some decent blocking. Gets down to the 23 yard line, second and seven. Broncos are in a situation to actually take the lead. They can get a nice stop right here. Second, and then it's gonna be hit up to Lewis, who knock at the first down, two yard or two yard gain, third and five. Now this might be the play of the game. A minute left. Lewis is gonna get the handoff again, and it's gonna be unsuccessful. And Broncos will get back the ball. Color last timeout. No timeouts. Forty seconds to go. Clock is ticking. First and ten. Now first Stark is gonna hand it, throw it off to Julius Thomas, and keeps this game going. A field goal is going to tie this game up. A touchdown is going to win it. And it's going to complete to Jordy Nelson who gets into the end zone. And this will pretty much do it for the Bisons right here. Broncos take the lead 31-27. One second left. Fourth and ten. A miracle drive if you ask me. Let's see if Alex Smith can actually do it. And he's going to underthrow that play. And Broncos take the game 31-27. Nice come behind victory. So if you guys like the video, subscribe and comment. I'll get some videos from the the Marco series and video come below. So it's pretty nice to me. So my person, I'll see you guys later tomorrow. Don't know what video that be. Probably some person champs, maybe some can't see Rose franchise. We will see. So see ya.